What's up, ladies and gents, boys and girls? It's JD, the most fly guy in tech and digital. The same guy bringing you that visual. Today, we're talking about two phenomenal women who are about to save the world. And let's just give it up for women. They bring life into the world. Like Beyonce said, they run the world. And now, we're about to find out that they're saving the world. And they're doing this by fighting the plastic problem and helping aquaculture. So let's get into the challenge here. If you do not know, there's a huge problem with the world's plastic waste in our oceans. There's too much plastic in the world and it tends to stay around for hundreds of years with only about 9% of the plastic ever produced getting recycled. The rest ends up in landfills or in the environment with 8 million tons entering the waterways yearly. This plastic shows up in our tap water and it smothers small organisms in the ocean that are part of our food chain. If this continues, it can affect the way we consume our food and the way we drink our water. And I know a lot of people like seafood and a lot of people rely on water. So you get the point. Plastic has a huge effect on the way of our life. Thankfully, two women with brilliant minds are out to solve the plastic challenge. These two women go by Jeannie and Miranda. They have used biology and disruptive technology to create bacteria that eats plastic and produces water to restore our oceans and seafood. They are doing this by using microbes. Microbes are tiny forms of life that are too small to be seen by the naked eye. You can find them in water, soil, air, and our bodies is home to a lot of these microbes. Microbes are also used to create antibiotics and pharmaceutical drugs. Jenny and Miranda are using biotechnology to use microbes to upcycle plastic waste for valuable products in aquaculture. The process they are using requires two steps. Step one, optimize microbes that are naturally able to break down plastics and then making them extract energy from carbon source. Step two is to bioengineer microbes to produce high value value product for aquaculture. So they are using plastic eating microbes for water and vaccines for fish to protect and grow fish in our ocean. So if you love seafood, you should definitely be thankful for these women as they are having great results and they are on their way to help the world. Now I know what you're thinking right now. You're thinking to yourself, Jacoby, how can I do my part? How can I help these women save the ocean? Well, the most fly guy in tech and digital, the same guy bringing you that visual, I have the visual for you right now. You can do your part by making sure you're recycling all your plastics in your household. Also, encourage others to do the same. Then, when you're eating fish, Make sure the fish is sustainable by going to the Monetary Bay Seafood Watch website or download their app to check out their recommendations. It's really easy. They have places you can go like Whole Foods to buy sustainable fish and also tells you the restaurants you can go that serve sustainable fish. You can also join your local shoreline cleanup project and spread the word. Now, if you want to learn more about Jenny's and Miranda's company and how they're using biotechnology, you can do so by visiting their website and doing your research. I added their website in the description box below. And as always, thanks for watching my video. I'm JD, the most fly guy in tech and digital, the same guy that brings you that visual. He has a visual for you right now. So did you know it's a proven fact that generosity makes you a happier person? So if you're generous enough, I'd appreciate it if you hit the subscribe button and notification bell so you can stay updated on my weekly video. Also, check me out and follow me on my social networks so we can engage in friendly dialogue. I post often and I want to see you post and engage with you. Have a great day. Yeah.